Running back situation, I mean, it's pretty well known. Nick Chubb's a pretty talented guy. You know, your, assess <laughs> uh, your assessment of him after kind of working with him and working with NFL backs and stuff like that. I mean, what's what's his what's his future look like? Uh, well, obviously, uh, he's a bulldog for a long time, uh, but uh, tremendous young man first and foremost. Uh, again. Uh, you know, your first exposure to these guys is always in the classroom. Uh, that's one of the things I always look to evaluate because if you can't learn the playbook and you can't make adjustments and stuff in the classroom and then apply those to the field, it's, it's hard to play this game at a high level. Obviously, uh, very football smart, very bright. Um, again, but the work ethic he displays on the field, just the way he practices. Uh, I've been around a few guys that, that have worked like that. And um, again, I think He's very uh, mature beyond his years and what it takes to be uh, an elite player. Uh, just you watch the way the guy works, the way he finishes runs, uh, the way he uh, attacks individual when he and Coach Brown are just kind of doing some simple footwork drills or read drills or even pass protection. Uh, he, he attacks his craft. And so uh, obviously the ability, we've all seen that. I mean, uh, the, the sky's the limit for the guy. Um, but. Uh, Again, I, again, the thing I was most blown away about was just his work ethic, both in the classroom and on the field. And uh, again, when you do that, it tends to lead to success. Including your knowledge and experience from the NFL, how, how unique, how unusual is it for a program to be able to come back to back with guys like Curley and Joe? Well, obviously, again, I think it's, uh, you know, they've been putting out great backs here for a long time. Um, obviously, uh, you know, it's surprising when you just look at the numbers. I mean, you watch, you look at Sony, you look at, you know, obviously Todd going to where I come from. Uh, I mean, I think that that was obviously uh, something that, you know, I didn't uh, think about, but it makes perfect sense when you look at Todd going there. But um, again, you need multiple backs. And I think, you know, obviously Coach Rick, uh, Coach McClendon, uh, now Thomas, they all get that. I mean, they've all worked in, uh, we laugh at Thomas, he's all over this building. I can't go anywhere without seeing Thomas Brown's picture. So I always look at him and say, you must be a pretty big deal around here. But, you know, he played with no shot. So, uh, again, I think it's amazing. It speaks to, um, you know, the evaluation process and how well they've done that for a long time here. But then, obviously, how they develop those guys and, again, the selflessness. Because that's a big part. Uh, I've been some places where guys don't like to sh share carries. But, unfortunately, they're going to get tired. They're going to need blows. And, um, again, they need to have that chemistry and camaraderie to, to accept that.